I just doodle, really, and things just happen. Some of it's quite rude, and some of it's a little bit explicit. Some of it's like innards and carcasses. I've never really painted a bass guitar before until a couple of people at our label um, handed me a, about 15 of them and said, go and do your worst on, the, on these. And they just handed me some pens and went, right, go and deface these things. <laughs> when I went to art school, the first four or five months of the course, it was life drawing. So I was drawing naked people every single day for about four months. <laughs> I ended up just piling uh, different angles on top of each other and it ended up being, I don't know, interesting forms and just started playing around with what it suggested and sometimes it was quite explicit I suppose. <laughs> A lot of bands meet at art college, especially in London. I met Russell there and we ended up just chatting about music. It was a great of time. You know? There was a lot of similar mentality going on with certain people. And I know you meet good friends there, I think, who like the same things. When we're writing, um, everyone brings in parts, separate parts. Everyone's quite free with it. We just jam with it and see what happens. Sometimes it falls into place and a song immediately shows itself and sometimes you have to work on it for a couple of months and keep stepping back looking at it and things you see it differently you know after a couple of weeks or so. Yeah I'm starting to see forms now so like thighs and <laughs> oh I'm just gonna carry on to that. <laughs> The album cover is, is actually a reflection of um, one of the pieces I did. I just kind of remixed it really and it just it turned into this kind of beast. Everyone sees different things in it. There's evil deer, devil deer horns and female genitalia. <laughs> and, I don't know, it depends I suppose. It's like one of those um, Rorschach, yeah. the um, ink blot. You can see into other people's kind of uh, psyche with it now, I suppose. Yeah. Well, I chose music over art, I suppose, but I love them both. We're on the road a lot at the moment, so I don't get a chance to paint canvases anymore, but I do tend to try and draw every day if I can, which is a good release. I've always found if, if I try and force it too much, it's just, you know, it's with songwriting and painting, it just doesn't come, it doesn't work. Best to kind of go for it when you're feeling the mood, I think. Hopefully something will come out of it. When I'm confronted with a black camera, well, there's just the endless possibility of what could happen. You know? I never know when I'm done either. That's just, <laughs> sometimes it just looks right. <laughs> so I just made a complete mess of this bass guitar. There you go. Destroyed. <laughs>